think both of them, you know, bleed the colors green a little bit. I think Ryan's been here for four years now, and, uh, you know, I think one of the things that jumps out at me, he really uh, enjoys Bemidji State. He loves the community. He wants to be here. Uh, I think he'll be a loyal, uh, you know, addition to the program. So I'm excited about him. And then with bringing Pat back as a former player, I've always liked the idea of having someone on staff that's played here is an alum. And, uh, you know, just getting to know Pat uh, these last couple of weeks here, I'm really excited about him. He's a good young coach. I think some players uh, that have only been out of, you know, their playing careers a couple of years struggle in the coaching aspect, but um, he's, uh, he's embraced it very well. I, I think he's going to be a good young coach. He is a young coach, um, and we're excited to have him here because I think, uh, uh, again, he's one of those guys that believes green, and, um, you know, we want that in our coaching staff. Yeah, I think it really has. Uh, and that's part of the reason why Ryan um, is with me today. I just felt like um, he would be able to keep the program running smoothly. There wouldn't have been a, a drop off. You know, I'm still learning where every building is here on campus, and Ryan certainly knows Bimini State in and out. And then having Pat on board as well uh, is the same type of a thing, I think. Pat knows Bimini State inside and out. So it makes my transition much easier, and, uh, you know, uh, you know, we'll be leaning on those two guys here in the next uh, couple of years. So we're looking forward to it.